the evacuation process. Have you been up all night? You're crazy, Ellie. Just dedicated. And Jack can't help. He's too busy with all the stuff Ebony's making him do. Ebony. Well, I saw Wolf, though. Oh, that guy. Don't knock him, sis. He gave me a big story. Oh, yeah? Here, you can be the first to read all about it. Come here. Shh. It's time to go. Five minutes? No. You don't want anyone to see you leaving here, do you? I don't care who sees me. Including Alice? Hmm. Yes. It's good. Alice, what's with you? Oh, I'm sorry. I've got a lot on my mind. Are you sure it's right? Of course. I mean, is it true? I wouldn't print it if it wasn't. And I trust Wolf. You mean you fancy him? Alice, he came from the North. He saw it for himself. The Chosen are finished. They've split, broken up. Right. You're not really listening, are you? I've got to go. I'll see you later. Yeah, okay. I'm sorry, Ali, you're right. It is great news. Lex. Oh, uh, hi. What are you doing? Oh, I, I wanted, uh, well, actually, I wanted to talk to Trudy. And since you've been spending so much time with her, I thought, well, I'm going back to look after Brady now, so you want to come with me? Great. Tyson, can I talk to you about Lex? Y yeah, what about him? When was the last time you saw him? Uh, a little while ago. Why? Well, I just went by his place, and he wasn't there. Mm. I'm sure there's a simple explanation. Yeah, but his bed. Yeah? It hadn't been slept in all night. Do you know where he could have been? Yeah, uh, well, look, it's like this, Trudy. Really. Um, I just thought that it was about time we cleared the air between us. Lex, are you okay? Sure. Why? You look whacked. Oh, I, I didn't get much sleep last night. Something on your mind? Well, yeah, actually. Um, I was thinking of you. Well, I mean, I, I know I've been keeping my distance ever since you got back, but it's because I feel so guilty. I see. I don't. Look, I really did try to save you that day on the beach with the Chosen, and it wasn't really my fault that everything went wrong. I know. I mean, they were really going to kill me. Lex, I know. You do? Yes. And I forgive you. In fact, I'm grateful to you. What are you saying, Trudy? But out of this, huh? It's between Trudy and me, right? It's all right, Patsy. If it hadn't been for Lex, I would never have had the chance to sort myself out. <coughs> Discover my true path. You did me a big favor, Lex. Thank you. Not done yet? It's a bit trickier than we expected. Where's Jack? He's had to have a comfort break. What's the matter with you guys? You got no control over your bodily functions? It's being around all this water. In fact, there he is now. 
You feeling better for that? Better? If you spend more time working and less in the bathroom, we might get this thing finished. Oh, well, um, <laughs> you, you know how it is when you, um, when you, when you gotta go. <laughs> Listen, I wanna swim in that pool and I can't till you've got the filter working again, right? Not unless you wanna get sick. There could be all sorts of bugs in that water. So fix it. And soon, or else. Oh, no, that, that, that was, that was close. <laughs> you find anything in the tapes? Nothing useful, no, but we're just gonna have to keep on looking. No, Jack, um, this spying game, it's getting too scary for me. You'll now see what I've been going through on my own. Trudy? Yes? Do you really forgive Lex? Of course I do. Trudy! Trudy, have you heard the news? No. What news? The Chosen, they're finished! Look! What, is this true? Allie got the whole story from Wolf last night. Isn't it great? It's fantastic! Oh, Brandy, baby, we're safe! You don't have to hide anymore. Oh, Trudy, we are so happy for you. After all you've been through. And I'm happy for you. For both of you. For us? Sure. After everything you've done, all the work you've put in, into making a new world, it was terrible to think people like the Chosen might destroy it all. It's fantastic. I can hardly believe it. What's going on here? Next, where have you been? Uh, chicken security. All night? Yeah. Well, you can never be too careful, right? Well, you don't have to be so careful anymore. What? It's a Chosen. They're gonna attack. No, no. They're all washed up. Are you serious? Yeah. It's in here. Yeah. Ellie's done a great job. Trudy. Oh, Trudy, we're so happy for you. Why don't have a seat? We'll get someone to get you breakfast. Chloe? Thank you. I... I still haven't really taken it in yet. So what happened? Did somebody smash them? Well, nobody knows, but my guess is Trudy has something to do with it. Trudy? How come? Well, if the Chosen worshipped Brady so much, and when Trudy escaped and took Brady with her... They started blaming each other. That'd be enough to cause disharmony, certainly. What do you reckon, Trudy? It'd be nice to think I'd help them, but... I don't know. Well, I think we should celebrate. Let's have a party. A party? What for? KC, you haven't heard. Here, it's in the news sheet. What do you think, Trudy? Do you feel up to it? You'd be the guest of honor, of course. I think it's a great idea. And we'll be celebrating you coming back to us as well. And Brady. Now we can have a rat race. Mm, I don't know about that. Why not? Yeah. Yeah, why not? I think it'll be a great idea. I think it'll be fun, Bray. Uh, we're all mole rats, and we've won. It'll be kind of symbolic. <laughs> Starting to sound like Tyson. <laughs> okay, okay, this afternoon then. Yes! I'll spread the word. Don't cry, baby. I'm not a baby. No, of course you're not. I'm not like her. You mean Patsy? It's all Trudy's fault. I wish she hadn't come back. You mustn't say that. We've got to be patient with Trudy. I hate her. No, no, you don't. Not really. Look, I'll tell you what. Casey's going to hold his race this afternoon. How about we try find you a rat to enter? Could we? Yeah. I'm sure Ryan could catch one for you. Okay, here's the bait. Now let's see him go for it. <laughs> see, good day. The more he can't get it, the harder he tries. Yeah, not bad. Let's see him do it again. I don't want to tire him out. Right. But he's got to know where the food is. Oh, he'll know. And if you bet on him, you'll clean up. I don't bet on anything. Unless I know it's gonna win. Oh, he's gonna win, Lex. Trust me. Mm. 
No go. Sorry, Chloe. I don't know where the vote got to. I need to set a trap. There's no time. The race is this afternoon. I know. Why don't we try at the farm? Yeah. There's bound to be plenty of rats out there. Be my guest. Cheers. Yeah, it's good stuff. Yeah. Have another. Lex. Hey, what are you doing here? I'm looking for you. Come here. That better? Mm, that'll do for now. You want a nibble of my apple? Lex. <laughs> Come on, have a bite. Thought I might find you here. Oh, um, hi, Trudy. Tysan, I'm, I'm not interrupting anything, am I? Of course not. What would you be interrupting? It just looked like there was something, um, private. No, nothing important. Well, that's okay then. Lex, I've been looking for you. Yeah? Uh, why? Well, I just thought after our little chat this morning, we might do something to celebrate our new understanding. Sure. Um, what did you have in mind? How about dinner tonight? My place. You don't mind, do you, Tysan? Why would I mind? Well, that's settled then. Just you and me, Lex. Sounds good to me. Um, what about? Oh, Patsy, look after Brady. Won't you, Patsy? Sure. I'll cook something really special, okay? Okay. See you later then. What else can I say? down. If he says he'll get you a rat, then he will. But it'll be too late. We'll never make it back in time for the race. Don't cry, sweetheart. It's only a game. It's not worth breaking your heart over. It's not just the race. What then? I don't have a friend anymore. Nobody cares. <laughs> You've got Cloudy. And Casey. What about Casey? Casey doesn't care about anybody except himself. You've got me and Ryan. But what about when you guys aren't around anymore? What if something should happen to you? What would I do then? Baby, you gotta stay sharp and make me rich. What do you think? It's excellent. I'm just gonna make sure they can't get over the sides. You're doing a great job. So where were you last night? Gambling den? Alice. It's okay. I know you weren't drinking. Boys gotta have some fun. Yeah. Only next time. Take me with you. Girls gotta have some fun too. Hey, Lux! Come here. Look at this. What do you think? Yeah? Not bad. I tell you, he's gonna walk it. Wouldn't he do better running? Is she trying to be smart? She's just joking. Hi, Allie. How's it going? Fine, thanks. Can I give you a hand? Yeah, that'd be great. Well, you just put him over there, right? 
You mean leave them? People have got to see the runners before the race, so they can decide which one they want to bet on. Well, yeah, yeah, sure. But I'm telling you, you put your bet on this one. Max can't bet. What? Why? Well, Danny's right. You're chief steward. You're in charge. Yeah, right. Hey, Casey. What you got there? Water for the rats. Got to think of their welfare, right? That's good, Casey. You can't have them dying of thirst, can you? Well, not before the race, anyway. So where'd you get the water bottles? I found them in the pet store. OK, Lex. Hand them to my sister. Who? Alice! Yeah? Alice is your assistant. Chief Steward's assistant. Right, Alice? Right. Don't we make a great team? It's not fair. It's just not fair. What are you crying for? Brian, you know why. She really wanted a rat. What? You mean one of these? He caught one. Brian, you're wonderful. Yeah? Yeah. You're the sweetest guy I've ever known. You'd better get back to the mall. Double quick. Now, are there any more entries? No? OK. Well, please make sure your rats have enough water and make sure that they have the right color on the bags. Alice is looking happy. Yeah. Well, she's having a good day. Because she's with you. Oh, Lex, what are we going to do? Look, I don't know. But I know what we're not going to do. What's that? We're not going to stop seeing each other. Well, we have to talk about that. Yeah. Why don't you come to my place after the party? We can spend the evening together. Have you forgotten about Trudy? Oh, Trudy. Trudy and her special dinner for two. You're not jealous, are you? Well, of course I'm jealous. Look, you can trust me. Can I trust Trudy? Well, I gotta go, babe. I mean, as you always say, I've gotta maintain this new harmony with her. Quite a crowd. Yeah. You should be the guest of honor at this party. Me? You brought the good news about the Chosen. How does it feel to be a hero? Pretty good if it means I get to spend more time with you. Hi. Jack, has Ebony let you out then? Yeah, we um, heard about the party. A great, isn't it? You know Wolf? Hi, Jack. You're a bit of a techie, right? We well, scientists, actually. There's a difference? I was just telling Wolf he's my hero, and this whole thing's down to him. Come on, Lex. Now this is where we clean. Lex? Oh, no, it can't be. They're all very quiet, aren't they? I wonder why. Wait till the racing starts. It'll be different then. Lex, I gotta talk to you. Not now, Casey. I'm busy. Yes, now. I gotta talk to you. We've made it. They haven't started yet. Put them over here. Alice. Hi. Where have you been? Getting this. To put in the race. I'm sorry. You're too late. But it hasn't started yet. No, but all the tracks are full. There's no room for another runner. Ah. Uh -huh. I'm really sorry. Hey, everybody, listen up. I got something to say. All bets are off. What? what? Why? No, because Casey's rat, the favorite, has been stolen. Oh, Who does something terrible like that? Whoever it is, I'm going to find them. And when I do, never mind that. Get on with the race. Yeah. Hey, hey! Without Casey's rat? Yeah. Wait a minute. What? If Casey's rat's not here, there'll be room for yours. Right, Alice? I suppose so. Pass him, hero. I'll put him in lane four. No more bets. They're all under starters' orders for the Grand Morad Derby. Get ready. Get set. Go! <laughs> until they're finished. Looks like they've finished already. Yeah, and I smell a rat. Come on, Ready. Keep going. Let's go, Ready. Come on, Ready. Let's go. Keep going. Yes, we've won. We've won. Ryan, you're a star. 
Why? You found Ratty for Chloe. You found him for her. I love you, Ryan. Do you hear me? I love you. You do? Will you marry me then? What? I said, will you marry me? <clears throat> Sorry. Don't worry. It shows you enjoyed it. Enjoyed it? It was fantastic. I don't think I've tasted anything as good as that since... I don't know. Since Zandra cooked that amazing chicken dish for our honeymoon. Poor Zandra. Where'd you get the meat from? Ah, but that'd be telling. A girl's gotta have some secrets. Very unusual. You don't know what you're missing out on being a vegetarian. Oh, but I do. I'm just happy you enjoyed it so much. Sure did. So, what do we do now? What we do now is we say goodnight and you go back to your room. Are, are you sure? I mean, we've got the whole night ahead of us. Lex, just be grateful for what you've had. I am. So good night then. Good night. And thanks. It was very delicious. He would have made me a fortune. Chloe's rat would have stood a chance. Nor any of the others, eh? Funny that they seem sleepy. Probably just tired. Probably, yeah. It's getting late. I gotta go. Do you have to? Things to do. Be seeing you. If I see you first. Jack? He's been hanging around you all day. He's a nice guy. Yeah. Real nice. And good looking. Good looking. Charming. Charming. A hero. A hero. But he's not you, Jack. You're the one that I want. time. We're ready. Yes. 